Hi guys, the cheapest and most safest coins on the whole internet. Check out MuleFactory.com and use the code ONFEEV at checkout for a discount. They have a 100% safe comfort trade and they also do lots of different deals with coins and also different players as you can see down below. Check them out, there's a link in the description. Hey guys, what's going on today? Welcome back to a brand new video. This is going to be a video showing you how I've made 50 million coins on this FIFA. This is the team that I currently have, um, and obviously a few players on the bench as well, like Messi, Croy, Hollett, etc. Um, but yeah, there's quite a few good little players here, I suppose you could say. Um, obviously R9 leading the attack, but we do play in a 4-4-2. Obviously, he wondering why Mbappe CDM. These two obviously swap around, etc. But yeah, this team's worth about 4, uh, 20, like 29, 35 mil at the moment. Maybe about 46 with a bench but they were about 50 million when I bought it obviously if you want the exact amount we've got the 3.3 up there as well this is basically how I trade guys with these expensive cards you can see here I do a lot of icon trading you can see right now this guy here Blanc you sell on an average so you don't want to buy listen for 146 is that right now we're listening for 157 but to do this guys you've got to filter out icon deals so you want to go into here now and you want to type in icons so obviously we go to here icons and then there's a way of doing this which is really good so you can put into either here like like a max price if you want to or a max buy now it's up to you so what i tend to do is put in like 500k into here and search in i find to be quite effective obviously there's quite a few pages that there's always going to be obviously you've got to get through them all first which is the main issue is getting past all the pages that is one of the most difficult bits but it is thursday it is weekend league so there should be some deals coming up um there might even be some obviously things going up in price fluctuations are at a perfect time right now let's say for example this figo here is 460 obviously you don't want him del piero 290 again he's already that sort of price Sanchez 195, not interested. Eto 295, not interested again. You just gotta filter out the deals that you know are good. So obviously like this skulls for 159 is nothing special. Ashley Calder here at 257. It wasn't be bad like a couple of weeks ago, but now again he's one of them that started to drop. Yashim for 165 here. Okay, I'm sure you can get like so what I do now is guys, I'd have this and then I'd go onto Footbin on my PC. I'd type in Yashim now quickly. 91 obviously. You look for what he's going for currently um, on an average, and that, guys, is a perfect example. There we go. So I'll list him at the end of the video. We'll go back and see him, sort him out in a bit. Um, but that right there is literally prefer, like, a perfect idea. Obviously, I've had to learn the prices now. Obviously, I you could tell that I knew that was a deal. That's why I checked it and whatever. So it's always worth doing that. This Figo here is, um, I thought it was a deal. He must have dropped as well because... He's pretty consistent at that price now. Maybe he is at a low, but yeah, Baggio here. This guy, I can't remember his price. So I thought he was about 360, though. I could be very wrong. Like, I could be really out um, here, which I am. He is literally perfectly priced at the moment. So yeah, nothing there to really go with. Um, same with this Essien, 270. Goes for about 290, but obviously nothing we can really do there. Deco at 135. Has sold pretty fast for some reason. Not sure what's going on there. Um, another Baggio look. Obviously a Kocha here too. Um, another Skulls getting listed. A few undercuts on him. Roberto Carlos at 285. Pretty good deal. Again, no complaints there. But you can see how I'm just staying in the 59th minute now. Obviously I'm not really close to the 59th. So obviously I'm going to miss quite a lot of deals. Obviously there's a chance for me to get some really good deals. But this Carlos Alberto here. Again, I'm one where I'm thinking he's only about 280. I could be wrong like I say. Um, a lot of the time that is the case, but um, it's definitely worth checking him here. And his average is, mm, yeah, it's about 275, so there's not a lot of profit in it. There is profit to be made. If I had loads more coins, I'd go and do it, but right now it's really not worth picking him up for that price. Um, obviously, Badger 300, we've checked him already. But this is all you do, guys, just keep scrolling through, and deals are there, you bet you will find them. Um, obviously, some of you aren't really interested in them right now. I'm just looking at the moments, really, at the moment. Um, but yeah, that's the 59th minute. So we're going to go back now, guys. Make sure you lift up with Yashin. You'll see that this is a perfect example at the moment. He's currently going for about 189. I can get that for him. That is literally the perfect price. So I'm going to go 187. Not a massive undercut, but it is a price that I'm happy to pay for him. Like this, basically here, this Vieira is. I bought three Vieiras earlier, as you can see, for like 880. Like. Um, around 880 890 even one for 850 and you can just see here now that he's going for like 980 already 969 so that's just a fluctuation straight away three of them up for that price obviously one sold already for 970 and this deal's pretty high though 
at 889 and 875 so obviously I can make a nice little profit and then 150 for this Sanchez here this was a really yeah he's dropped a little bit now like I thought he would I listed him a bit high because there's no real other deals up but yeah guys, that is the method that I use all the time with consistent icon trading any questions guys please let me know and ask I'll answer any questions that you need thanks for watching and I'll see you all